Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. It's Pastor Lewis Judy here. Today we're going to take a look at both of the 501st Battle Pack and the 501st Specialist Battle Pack. So we'll take a look at the first Battle Pack. So, or I guess technically not a Battle Pack, but whatever. So, we get a nice little walker for the 501st Legion. Oh. <laughs> These things do that a lot. They're not really the most stable thing. So it has a pretty ugly stud shooter, but I don't mind it. And a little binoculars, you can seat your clone trooper, on one of them, on there. And then we get a 501st speeder. It's a pretty long speeder. It just goes new. <laughs> and then we get two battle droids, droids in one set. And then just troopers in the other. So then we get three regular troopers. And then we get the five of first jet trooper. And then let's take a look at the five of first specialist. So, oh my god. <laughs> Sorry about that. I don't really like to stay. And then we get the five of first specialist. And then we get a little walker thing with a big cannon on top you can see one of your minifigures on that seat there and then you can and then you have uh the five of first sniper the five of first commander and two five of first gunners so those are all the troopers in total you get get eight total troopers and two battle droids unless you buy more of them which is what most people do you get about a hundred of them <laughs> maybe a million if you're one of those people which i'm not i just collect the sets to get the cool minifigures i would like more but i don't have the money or the time so i'm afraid i will not be doing that but if you want to, go on ahead. It's your choice. But I personally just collect one of each set, considering I only collect one of each set. So anyways, so that's the review of the LEGO Star Wars 501st Battle Pack and the 501st Specialist Battle Pack. I hope you enjoyed. Like and subscribe and stay tuned for some more awesome videos. Bye.